Hey guys, it's Martin here from Half Naked Human Productions, and today we are going to take down the Headless Horseman. Yeah, as you can see, it's easy being a tank in this fight. You just hold the aggro on him and let the DPS nuke him down, get the healer to heal you up so you can stay alive and keep holding aggro on this motherfucker. So, as you can see, every once in a while his head pops off, and then you have to nuke that one. That's what I think it's the most one of the most funniest boss fights in this game. Must be this this guy because yeah, well you can see <laughs> the head pops off. You're going to fight a floating head. How awesome is that? Yeah, as you can see, we're nuking him down. He only has 126k HP, so he's no biggie. He's not a tough guy, and there his head pops off again. And as you can see, we are doing pretty well. Here, there's Hammer Wrath. And now his head is back up for the last part of this fight. Yo, you came down, you came down. Hmm. And then he spawns those little sinister squashling sort of things. You can get a pet that looks just like it. And yeah, well, there you see the head pops off. And boom, boom, boom. He's down. And the loot we got was Magic Broom and the Horseman's Baitful Blade. It's a nice epic which can summon a pumpkin soldier. It's a use function which can be used every 10 minutes. So that's a fun little thing you should keep in mind to get. And I also dropped a ring. Yeah, there's the sinister squashling. It's uh, looks like the one you can summon. Yeah, well now I say bye bye.